month ago, our principal was shot to death in his office at school. Uh, as a result, we actually lost a great father, a mentor and a leader, an educational leader in all the meaning of the word. That's why we decided to uh, honor his memory by doing a mural with, by the initiative of the American Embassy. And thanks to the artist uh, Max Levy Frieda, who actually gave his time and dedicated his willingness and his creativity to just work with our students on a mural just to honor his memory. This is a memorial to nonviolence and being able to have it be where the ideas for the murals that are going to be in this school are going to be made by the kids who are going to be living here and that it can be something that really generates a source of creative empowerment. It's great to see so many students engaged in art to honor the late school principal. The pupils started the morning with a discussion describing their fear, feelings and hopes for the future. They are now expressing these emotions in art. Uh, I'm, I'm painting the hands because uh, they're symbolizing that people are coming out of the sea so they want to reach the peace. Uh, there are dogs in the sky, it resembles some peace and the angels are trying to help these poor people in the sea of violence in the society. So there are actually some faces that are shedding tears and crying for the, all these victims of violence. It's part of an initiative by the embassy, by the US embassy, to be able to take art as a way of generating uh, community pride and being able to have it be something that builds the community uh, in different environments throughout Israel would like actually also to thank Timbur for uh, giving us the paint and the teacher staff who actually gave us the space and the place to just reflect what we feel doing something for Abu Amir.